Happening right now at noon, a new year means new lawmakers. The 111th General Assembly is being sworn in at the state capitol. Let's go live to News 4's Carly Gordon. She's at the capitol right now. Carly, there are some major changes this time around. Yeah, Chris, we are witnessing the beginning of a new era here at the state capitol. 31 new lawmakers are about to be sworn in. 27 of them just through those doors in the House. Glenn Casada will be taking over as House Speaker, and Jack Johnson is the new majority leader in the Senate. Not to mention, in a couple of weeks, Governor Bill Haslam will leave office, and incoming Governor Bill Lee will take over. So what do all of these changes mean? Well, the legislature is certainly losing a ton of experience, but many are hopeful fresh blood will mean positive changes. As for what the issues will be, we think our nation's opioid crisis will be a big focus. Incoming Governor Bill Lee has talked about criminal justice reform, and we just spoke to a lawmaker who has already introduced a bill to legalize mobile sports betting. So a lot of possibilities here. We will be here keeping you informed. Anything could happen, but again, it all starts right here, right now. A lot of activity there at the Capitol with News Force Carly Gordon. Hey, Carly, anything of interest or out of the ordinary happening out there today? Well, there was one protester here. In fact, he's still here right now. He's been yelling for about an hour now about the Nathan Bedford Forest bus saying there is no room at the state capitol for Nathan Bedford Forest. This was a big issue last session. Several people tried to get that bus removed. Clearly, they were unsuccessful. And if today is any indication, we'll be hearing about it more this session as well. Chris. All right. That's Carly Gordon live at the Capitol. Thanks for joining us here.